Hi hey guys, I'm going to show you how to restore Windward player files from backup. Say for example I did something uh, bad, like unequip an item, then accidentally destroyed it, or whatever. Or say for example there was a bad patch that wiped out my inventory when equipping something. Well, you can actually restore your player file quite easily. Windward makes hourly backups and you can revert to either one of these at will. Here's how to do it. First, you'll want to exit the current game. Go back to the main menu. Once here, go to single player, select the existing character that you want restored, and click delete. This deletes the player file, both from the Steam's uh, cloud save as well as the local save. The next thing you need to do is locate the backup folder. For me, it is located in My Documents Windward Backup. If you're on a Mac, find the Documents folder there instead. Here you can have you can actually see all kinds of backups, hourly backups from your earlier playthroughs. What you're actually looking for is the latest backup uh, that was still valid. So, for example, for me, this one was at 1.06 p.m., which was half an hour ago. I'm going to restore this file. I'm going to copy it, then go to Windward, uh, Players, and drop it here. Now, if this player already exists, then you did not follow the earlier instructions where you had to delete the player file from within the game. Then you have two options here. You can uh, either go back and repeat the instructions correctly this time and delete it from within the game, or you can copy the player file under a different name. Which one you prefer is up to you. Depending on the version of the game that you have, there may also be a space at the end of the uh, player name. This was done at one point to uh, create unique names, just to make it uh, easier to copy-paste. So you may want to change it back to what you wanted it to be. Now you can actually go back to the game and you will want to restart it. I'm just doing it in the Unity editor because it's easier for me. Now go back to single player and choose the player from the drop-down list. Just continue playing, go back to the world and you should have everything back. And that's how you do it. Thanks for watching.